Alright, hello everybody, welcome back to Let's Play Isle to Sturmovic Iron Man. Uh, last time I expressed a bit of confusion over the um, the campaign not switching, basically. Um, and us not getting our new planes, given it's September 1st. Uh, the reason for that is, I went and checked, and um, basically the, the, the next phase of the campaign, the Defence of London, actually starts on the 8th of September, not the 1st of September. So we've got a few more missions to get through before um, we can get to the next and final phase of the Battle of Britain. Um, we've already survived like way longer than I thought we were going to, so I'm not complaining or anything. We're living on borrowed time, I feel like, at the minute, honestly. Um, and I have a feeling there's four of us going up here, but we're covering an airfield rather than on some sort of, some sort of random patrol. I have a feeling this time it's not going to be as easy as the turkey shoot that ensued last time where we, uh, if you recall, basically uh, ambushed a bunch of BF-110s that were busy shooting up. I think it was either Hawkins or Limp, I can't remember. But uh, yeah, they were strafing it and dropping bombs on it and stuff. And we caught them completely by surprise, dived down on them and um, tore them a new one. We alone got four kills, so the others got a few as well. So... Yeah, we kicked ass, basically. Uh, I don't think we even lost a single friendly fighter on that mission. Single friendly plane, for that matter, because there were a few Blenheims that went over and uh, bombed these airfields over here. Um, so, yeah. Pretty good, pretty good. But today we're going to be protecting Biggin Hill and Kenley. Um, so let's get on with it, shall we? I don't know what we're going to be facing. It's probably going to be a full force this time, I imagine. Um, 109s, 110s, bombers, the lot, I imagine, because it's an airfield defence this time, so there's definitely going to be bombers, if nothing else. Question is, do we have any body coming along to help us, since there's only four from our squadron? Have we got any el anyone else from other squadron? If, if it's just three hurricanes, then God help us, because we're not even going to be able to land our own airfield this time. <laughs> Let's have a look. Alright, there's us. Look at the engine started. Us four, and one, two, three, four, five, six, hello, hang on, six hurricanes, I think, yeah. All right, six hurricanes from the Polish squadron, and us. That means it makes ten in total. I don't know, that feels like a reasonable-ish number, but we'll see. Um, I was hoping for maybe eight of us, and then a bunch of hurricanes, honestly, but uh, whatever. Ground control, can we take off? Gotcha. Let's go. up. Gear up. Okay, well there we go. I guess I'm going to be doing a few circuits over the field to let everyone else catch up and uh, then we'll get climbing like madmen um, until we reach 23, 24,000 feet and then we're going to wait and see what has come to play. Uh, and God help us if it's lots of them. Alright, we just had the poles call out bombers 12 o'clock high. Um, they're below us for the minute, so... I'm thinking, right, red flight. Stay in formation. Are those the poles or are those ours? Those are ours. Okay, those are the spitties. So where are the bombers? That's Kenley down there, I think. And that's Biggin Hill just below us. In fact, that might not be Kenley, actually. I think that's probably... Yeah, somewhere else. That's Kenley. That's Biggin. And... Hello, bombers! Where are your escorts? If you don't mind letting us know. Those are the escorts, looks like. 
And the problem here is we could go after the bombers, but if we don't go after the fighters, they'll just shoot us down while we're trying to land out with, a, with us out of ammo, so... It's tricky, isn't it? Because no, otherwise no one's going to shoot the bombers, who have just blown the shit out of Biggin Hill. Holy crap. Um, well, first of all, I think I'm going to shoot this fella up here by himself. I'm going to keep the others on my wing for now, before we actually get gauged properly. Looks like the Hurricanes are having a rough time by the sounds of it. Ugh. Alright, red flight, get ready. You two here, especially you, actually. All right, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Oh, nice. I don't think anyone's on us. Looks like we might have this feather all to ourselves. Oh, you're going vertical, are you? Please do. It would make my life easier. Oh my god, just die. Come on. Wasting ammo. Where are the other two? That's my wingman back there, I imagine. I don't think he's in the mood to fight by the looks of things, so I think we'll ignore him for now. Generally, when you when you give him engine damage like that, they don't put up much of a fight afterwards, so. Alright, what about you two? Dressing away back towards. I don't go. God knows where! Oh, hello, never mind. Where's your friend gone? Come on. They are fast 109s, generally speaking, they will beat you in a straight up chase. Let's see, he's getting away. Come on, do something. Move, go vertical, anything. I'm gaining on him, but I'm also worried about any friends he might have. I don't want this to turn into a classic dragon bag, with me being the bag. Damn it. Oh, 
on, give me some smoke, something. There we go. They may be, they'll maybe crash on the way back, but uh, they, uh, you know, main thing is I just want them to disengage and leave me alone. It sounds like he took a pasting. I don't know where he is, to be honest. The other half of our little flight here kind of disappeared on us. About to run out of ammo, not good. Okay. Oh, he just pulled the hammerheads, which looks really weird when the AI does it, because that's not what a real hammerhead looks like. Looks like we've got a smoking wingman here. vertical before we black out from having too much speed I have almost no ammunition left that's the thing that's got me a little bit worried at the minute because I emptied some bullets into this guy but none of them actually gave me the kind of damage I wanted or is he running away now I hope he is I'm going to maintain altitude for now um Red flight, tactical, regroup. Uh oh. Right, red two still with us. Red four is, but he's also being attacked by the sounds of it. He's still moving away. So red three bought the farm. So who's this? I think red two is smoking. Um, looks like our friend's coming back. Yeah, looks like we've got two and four with us now. So come on then, if you think you're hard enough, you're out number three to one, mate. Pitch 10%, good grief. Um, where's he gone? I lost him now. Bollocks. Oh, I know, there he is. Okay. Oh, looks like we've got more incoming, great. Uh, why didn't you engage the one that was right here? Why did you have to go drag these guys into it? Jesus. Now we're outnumbered, you idiot. Ugh. Six clean and everything will be fine. Right, let's see. I'm we're just I'm in defensive flying mode like crazy here. I've got no ammo left virtually. Probably like another 
one or two second burst at most. Probably not even that, frankly. Now I've got these guys to deal with, and we're right above our own airfield, more or less, so it's not like I, I can land either. Because I'll just get strafed. Alright, one's gone down. Tell you what, ground control. Press assistance. They're sending fighters to our location. Nice. Okay. collision there for a second. Uh-oh. Break, 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 come on. Ugh, close. Control. We need more assistance. We need it now. Hey, another one went down that shot earlier. Nice, okay. That's not going to count for anything, though, if I get killed. I mean, it's not any of these guys going down. <laughs> uh oh. Oh god, there we go. Spotted him a little too late. This was still airborne for now. Oh god, now more of them are taking shots at me. I wonder where those fighters we were promised have got to. Engine's overheating, yep, that's because it's probably about to die. Right, I need to put this thing down. Where the fuck's Biggin Hill? Come on, this way. Maybe Friendly Flack will give us a hand. Another one. <laughs> I can see flat tracer shooting, so maybe we're in luck. Oh, Christ Almighty! Right, like, looks like he bro broke off because these guys coming to help. Oh, nice! <laughs> what happened there? I guess he stalled out. Yeah, come and play with the flak. Oh yeah, maybe had flak hit him actually, come to think of it, and I got the credit or something. Oh Christ, that was close. I do have a tiny bit of ammo left, I could always try and scare him off. But I'm not going to, because I'm losing speed and red RPMs, I think, soon. Ground control, give us some help.
out of ammo, yeah. yeah. Damn. I might have to go for a crash landing. I hope that these guys shoot, manage to shoot these feathers down or something. So I'm officially useless now. Alright, we'll try a wheels down landing on this runway here. Desperate. Some of the poles are still around, amazingly enough. I would have thought they'd be all shot down by this point, but I guess not. Alright, come on, brakes, brakes, brakes. So I can stop and get out. ground loop. This, no, no, okay, we're good, we're good. A bit further off the runway if you please. That'll do. Stop. And out we get. Just to be on the safe side. Oh yeah, look at that. Hurricane's chasing these guys back to France. What about our spits though? That's what I want to have a look at. Okay, we've got JXR and that, right, this is either number two or number four, and the other one over there is the other one. It looks like the Germans might be leaving. No, they're definitely not leaving. Oh boy. Break, dude. Break. <laughs> Never mind. Flight got him. <laughs> Take that. <laughs> Excellent. Looks like we're, we're home free then. Nice. Right then, let's have a look at the hurricanes for a bit, and uh, then we'll call it a day. Hopefully these guys can get these last two bombers. Oh, what the hell is he doing? Wow, crashing apparently. I guess maybe his pilot was killed or something. There you go, the rest of something or other. This guy's headed home, I don't blame him. Looks like I'll, my wingmen are heading back out to, conf to finish their patrol or something? I don't know. Probably should have told them to return to base before I got out. Hmm. Well, guys, I'm going to wait around for a bit and see if any other enemy aircraft go down um, from damage. And uh, I will meet you guys on the debriefing screen, I guess. Alright, mission's over. Looks, let's see what happened. God, there's lots of blue all over the countryside. So let's see. Yeah, that hurricane went down, shot down by the Ju-88 he was chasing. This Ju-88 was shot down. This one crashed. Looks like these guys went in when they were trying to land. Hurricane went down by Ju-88. Ju-88 that went down, shot down by a hurricane. Interesting. All right, yeah, we got this E3 on his way back. That one on his way back. That one on his way back. <laughs> Yeah, these guys crashed as a result of damage I given them. See, that's why I broke off, basically, because you damage them enough, they just run for home. And eventually, hopefully, when they've got as much distance to go as this, they crash on the way home. And that's what these three did. So, nice. Uh, and over the field, this guy was shot down my flak, shot down my flak, and this one we got the credit for. Don't exactly know how. I'm guessing he's one of the ones I got some shots into but couldn't get smoking towards the end there. And... I think when he went down eventually, either due to damage to his, you know, wing surfaces or something, causing him to stall and crash, or flat got him and then I got the credit, whatever. We got four freaking kills, guys. <laughs> yeah, um, four Spitfire 1s, six Hurricanes. Unfortunately, Pilot Officer Stewart was killed. Over here. 
bailed out. I think his shoot failed. Shot down by one and ninety three. Stuart, wait, hang on a minute. Stuart bailed out here, but was killed here. The f what the fuck happened there? Was his parachute shot or something? I don't know. Hurricane went down over there. Two, of the, I think, two of the hurricanes at least survived that actually, because they were on their way back when I um, quit the mission out. So not even all the AI hurricanes were killed this time. So yeah, once again, it seems, even though Big and Hill got the shit bombed out of it, we we won. Um, and Kenley, Christ, look at that. Um, actually, looks like it was, yeah, I think it was just Kenley that got bombed. Yeah, cars destroyed, aircraft statics. Ouch. But even so, um, we shot way more of them down than us were shot down. So that was awesome. That was really freaking awesome. It gives us a confirmed kills list of 23 in total, not including the ones we got at Dunkirk. Let's apply, see what happens. Flight Sergeant Hay, hey, whatever, joined the squadron. It's September 2nd now, so oh, it's like these last few days of September, or last few days of this campaign, not September. We're going to drag out a bit. Air raid. Enemy bombers reported inbound from the southwest. Take off immediately. Hey, there we go, guys. This was the scramble type mission that people were asking about. Um, this this is it. This is we're, we're about to get one. Looks like there's eight Spitfires taking off as well. So there's probably going to be a lot of them too. So, yeah, what's going to happen here, judging by my ex previous experience with this kind of mission and other campaigns, the enemy will be really close by. They will be like here already by the time we're starting to take off. So we need to get off the runway as fast as we can, get as much altitude as we can, and shoot down. The bombers will probably get the bombs off, and then we will end up chasing them back, um, is what will happen. See, look, the altitude's at 12,000 feet, you know. It's quite low down. So, yeah. Ooh, this should be exciting. Um, provided we aren't killed. <laughs> but, yeah. Well, okay, yes. That, so this time they're actually coming for Big in Hill, where the last couple of times they were evidently going for Kenley. Uh, they must have heard about me. They're, <laughs> they're trying to kill me on the ground. <laughs> 16 sorties, 23 kills. Nice. Have we got Bloom going up with this? Oh, of course not. We've got Harper, Mesa, Brackenbury, Longdon, Anholt, Bailey, and Hay. Um, they don't ring any bells. Look, uh, yeah, they're all bloody sergeants. They're all brand new. No kills between them. Mm. Oh, well. We'll see what we can do. But that will be next time, ladies and gents. For now, um, let's just revel in our victory and hope we don't get killed next time. Although, I, it's got to happen at some point because we've lasted a ridiculously long time so far. But anyway, I'll catch you next time, folks.